I just want to go through another situation or scenario with you um, if you don't have any power whatsoever. You hit the toggle switches and nothing happens. No clicking or anything, no sign of life from the electric motor. A um, couple of things to check on that side. Number one would be the inline breaker. So it does have a resettable breaker in line. Make sure that the breaker is, the yellow tab is actually in its seated position to reset it, re-trip it, hit the blue button, that brings the arm, hockey arm down, and just put it back in its spot, and then you have power running through the system. So what if you, you know, that is fine, you have uh, that, that's in its, its correct position, uh, you've got power kind of going to the system, but you still don't have anything. One other thing to check is there is an inline blade fuse that is going to the remote system, um, so that's one you know fuse obviously to check. Um, I would physically pull the blade out, look at the blade contacts to make sure they're not corroded, and put the blade back in, or just replace the blade. If then you still don't have any any um, any function, any 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 power coming uh, through the system, no operation. Uh, next thing would be to actually test and make sure the remote system inside is not faulty. One way you can do that is the orange and the green wire that are going to the trombetta solenoid are from the remote. One is to go up and one is to go down. So you can actually take your meter, um, put, put the lead, one lead, uh, orange is up, green is down, uh, put one lead basically right there, um, on the, on the orange, the positive of the orange, negative would go on the negative battery cable coming in. And what you'd want to do there is, let's test. So there we have 12.3 volts. So 12.3 volts, it is working. So that side of it is working. So we can plug that back in. If you don't have any voltage coming through there, then more than likely something internally inside of the remote is bad. Same with the green wire, the down. So once you hit the green, you hit down, test that. If you have voltage there, great. You have voltage going into the solenoid. Um, if not, then the remote system is bad. 